Yes, these are great. I can give you some of the example. Once you create table or listing, na, so in table what happen? You have to uh, generate in most of the table, like let's suppose in a demographic table, you have to generate uh, n mean standard deviation minimum maximum. Now the sequence of n mean standard deviation minimum maximum, uh, if you short, you might not get in that order, right? So you have to create a custom order. So if stat equal to n, let's suppose in the mock shell, if n you need to keep at the third. So then if stat equal to n, then order equal to three. So you can give custom order, right? And then short the order variable and you'll you'll get according to the order of mock shell, right? This is one logic. Second, a lot of time after doing, you know, uh, after doing, so we impute the missing value. So after imputing the missing date values, Okay, let's suppose if month is missing, you wanna imp impute, or day is missing, you wanna input, impute. So while imputing that, uh, the, the variable type will be character because imputing, like uh, adding uh, the values is not possible if it is in numeric, right? Mostly, if you're concatenating. So we'll do in, in a manner if, uh, uh, keep the variable in character and then do the pro concatenation and then you will make it, uh, you will convert the same variable into after doing the concatenation, after making a complete date from missing date, you will convert into numeric. So this is also in logic, right? Uh, first, imputing the missing values, missing date value, day, month, year, then converting into uh, from character to numeric in a, with the specific format as per the requirement. This is the second logic. So two logic I can tell you, but 